feel like an intruder. I don't feel like this is my home. I'm constantly in a state of just like I feel uncomfortable. Are you aware that you're no longer with us? <laughs> from. I heard I'm, I'm from beyond the grave. This is like the movie Poltergeist, but we're not just talking one house built on a cemetery. It's like the whole neighborhood's built on that same principle, and there's stuff going on everywhere. I've investigated a lot of different places, been on a lot of different cases, and the fact that this entire neighborhood is experiencing things is extremely rare. I just saw. Are you pointed over there? <laughs> Yep. He Holy saw me. This That's is freaking crazy. me the hell That's out. Crazy. Right near that window over here, there was a shadow figure that was just standing right here. Do you want us to see you? If you can hear us, please focus your message on the device in my hand. Scream! That was a scream! It's a brand new community, nice housing, but you go out into the street and it feels like no one is there. <laughs> He said, he said, whoa, 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 yeah, holy crap. Yeah, what was that? Is that door close? The lid door? Yep. Lift it up and look. Oh, we found it. That's never fallen before. I love what? you. I love what? you, bro. Oh Dude, my God. Says, Are you able to come inside the house from outside? What the hell was that? There's a sense of dread when I'm here. You just don't know what the night's gonna bring. But I've been having like physical things going on, waking up at night because it felt like somebody was covering my mouth or my nose so I couldn't breathe. I woke up feeling like there was a hand like really digging in to my inner thigh. It woke me up out of sleep and I was like, let go. The scariest thing in the world could be happening to us while we're asleep. We don't know what's going on. Down. Yeah, oh my yeah, god! Yeah. The neighbor, he actually tried to burn down his house. I happened to be in my driveway. We were hearing a state trooper. He had said that the guy told him that the voices told him to do it. If a voice told me to set my house on fire, I'm not going to set my house on fire. We would drive by here every night before we moved in. We're excited. This is our home. In the house, we could see it was a fire inside. What, your house? Yes. It was like right where I'm sitting, right here in the kitchen. Run from the fire. It felt like multiple things were trying to deter us from figuring out what the heck is really going on here. This area in general, the entire area, is, the land is definitely on. Why is this happening? Why is this happening to all of us? When we all moved here, nobody wanted to, to buy a haunted house. This is wild. I can feel the energy here still. Yes. Pray to God. Pray, Pray to God. God.